Ready or not, let's get in this whip. What's going on? We in the whip. I give you my heart. Yo, what's going on? Welcome back to the whip, son. Basically, we are doing Ready or Not. Ready or Not is a crazy, crazy movie starring Samara Weaving. I'm hoping I'm getting that right. If it's Samara or Samara Weaving. Um, it pretty much holds it down in this movie. It's crazy. It is crazy. I mean, they pretty much let you know from the sneak peek commercial and the preview what it really is. So this part would not be considered a spoiler so basically it's a rich very very rich family and one son who kind of eh, isn't really into the family business like he should be and they the family wants to bring him back into the into the fam you know because it's a family thing uh, it's a lot deeper than a family thing but it's a family thing so basically what goes down is he falls in love with Samara Weaver's character and they're gonna get married now tradition has it that anybody who wants to marry into the family on the night of their wedding the wedding night instead of consummating your marriage and getting it in with vigor and uh, unbridled passion and lust you're going to be playing a game of hide and seek with the family rich people can do that so I guess that's what they do um, so yo <laughs> it's crazy she's down you know she's like look I, I want your family to know that I'm not marrying you for this for your money that's not why I'm marrying you I'm marrying you because I want to contribute I want to be a part of your life and that's basically it I just want your family to accept me uh, yeah. it's gonna be a lot harder than you think okay for the family to accept her so basically she has to play this game of hide and seek. She has to survive the night. There is no turning around or reneging on this or, you know, copping out, whatever. It's, there's no backseas, okay, on this. So, and she, <sighs> dude is like, you look, are you sure this is what you want to do? Do you want to play the game? He gives her like two outs. Two outs he gives her. Like, yo, here's your opportunity. Here's your opportunity to just be out. Like, we can just be out. He said, we can just break away from the fam and go on our own and not be tied into the family. We can do that. And she was like, nah, I want your family to, I want your family to, to, to have respect for me. I, I, I want to be a part of this family, so this is what we're going to do. So, she goes for it. Turns out, this is the weirdest game of hide-and-seek she ever had to play. Whenever the little masses are presented with a new addition to the family, we place a blank playing card into the box. Our initiate then has the privilege of drawing the card, and Mr. LaBelle will tell us which game to play. <laughs> so I just take out the card? <laughs> what does it say, girl? <laughs> Let's hide and seek. Are we really gonna play that? Are 
or anything, okay? Back up in the whip, baby. Back, back, back up in the whip, baby. So yeah, so um, basically, she gets a little bit more than what she expects with this family. Uh, this one, I'm not throwing out spoilers. I'm gonna let you rock with everything that you saw so far as the commercials and the previews. I'll let you rock with that because it tells a lot. Like, they're going in half trying to catch this girl and kill her. It's all about sacrificing this chick before daylight. And that's all I'm gonna give you. I will say, um, I can't call predictability on this movie because they let you know what it is from the commercial. Like, there's no hiding it. It's hide and seek, survive, welcome to the family. That's the basic premise of the whole entire movie. But there is a twist at the end. You find out why they're doing this. And the reason why is kind of weird. So it's like, you're trying to find out if their reasoning for doing what they're doing and keeping out of tradition, if it's warranted or if it's just BS. And that's the whole real premise. To find out if this whole thing is just BS. And you're gonna be you're gonna be surprised. You're gonna be surprised on what you find out. Um, the girl holds it down, and because she does, I'ma give this a 3.5 out of 5, yo. That's one you might want to go and check out, especially if you haven't seen a lot of you know survival movies like that. Um, it took elements from a whole bunch of other movies as well to make this one particular movie. Uh, so I'll throw out another one, Surviving the Game, starring your boy Ice-T, is a classic survival movie that if you haven't seen it, you're gonna be like, wow, okay, <laughs> these dudes were crazy. That's one you're gonna wanna watch. I recommend that one. If you really, really want a nice, solid survival movie film. With a little urban feel to it, all right? Um, other than that, I'm about to run in here and get this coffee, and I'll see you on the next movie. Um, next movie will probably be, I want to say Angel is Falling. Uh, that'll be the next joint. In between time and, and in the meantime, in between time, or vice versa. I see you when I see you. Deuce.